Hello everyone, Mike Arnold here, co-founder of Patrick and partners along with Bob Agino. So quick Tesla update. We've talked about this a number of times on our podcast. We had this double bottom that was actually triggered back on December 11th. Ran up, hit stop production. We moved our stop just below the 50% level on a closing basis due to the volatility in Tesla. Kept running back up just yesterday. The most reliable target we talked about on the podcast too is the 352.43 the second target went into the wicks which we generally don't use so we round down the end of the clear path end of the clear path came in at 359.65 that was hit yesterday on the gap open and now we've pulled back the rotation zone so this pattern this double bottom on tesla finally played out yes some of these times they take a while to play out especially on daily charts just want to update because people say, what's going on with the double bottom in Tesla? What's going on? We're long Tesla. What's going on double bottom? Well, it finally hit its target, now pulling back, and it easily hit the first target. So if that's the only one you were using, that was the best one to use. The secondary target uh, is more unreliable when it does go into the wicks. Just keep that in mind for whenever you hear the double tops and double bottom patterns, if you see the uh, farthest target we have going into the wicks. But that's complete on Tesla. Do we know where Tesla's going? No. I mean, it could come back. It's now back to this prior peak, top of the rotation zone. You could easily rotate back up and go higher. But it's now completed this strong pattern. We still have a massive weekly double top that's still in play. It is not invalidated. So if we get the close below 300, that will be triggered. But at this point, we're a long way off. And there's no other pattern we have to trade right now unless we get a long trend line trade into this advanced clear path move which would trigger on a defining point above the uh, high of 360.50. So that's all we have for you on a quick Tesla update. We'll talk to everyone soon. Bye for now.